so you can see the off-road display in front of me. The newest technology on an off-road area. Hello guys, welcome to Birds Benz King. This is the all-new C-Class All-Terrain. And in today's video, we will actually take it off-road here in Germany. And you can see the design is also different. It has new front bumpers, a larger, greater grille. And the most important part is the ground clearance. Because of the tires and of course comfort suspension, it is 4 cm more ground clearance in total 13.7 cm. And yes, this is the estate. Also the rear has changed in the design. You can see a more robust area here from the bumpers. It is the C220D and that means there are only two engines available. Both are diesel and it is a melt hybrid. So you can see here the exhaust tips, amazing. With the C-Class All-Terrain, you can choose the wheels from 17 inch up to 19 inch. And now we are driving with the 18 inch rims. So let's go to the interior with of course the portrait style screen. And we'll take it for a drive. We'll close the door. There you can see a beautiful interior with the brown leather and piano vertical lines on the dash. So let's put on the seatbelt. And we can press the button for the electronics to work. And there you can see a beautiful 12 inch screen in front of us, 11.7 inch screen on the center console. So if I press the parking button over here, you can see it has a 360 degrees angle. Swipe to the right or left to see the full vehicle in 360 degrees. There's also a special curb button to see the left and right side amazing so if we zoom out you will see the off-road area on our right so let's put it into drive and we will go right here you can see we are going downhill into the off-road area you can also see it here on the screen amazing i have all the settings put into off-road so you can see the off-road display in front of me so on the left I see the side inclination on the right side the angle that we are driving and this might be a good time to put it into the off-road mode I go to dynamic switch to the left and there it says off-road set some maximum speed there you can see the sand icon so I will go up here on this hill and therefore I will press the park button just to see the camera because we always like to see it in bird view let's go amazing the newest technology on an off-road area. Let's see the right curb on the display. So that we are not scratching our rims with the bushes. And over here you can see we are at the mountain area with all the trees. So let's hit the home button. And I will show you guys some information of the off-road. We are facing the northeast. And let's go. On the other side we can see the mountain road. Beautiful. Down into the bushes. And I feel the car is slowing down by itself because of the off-road setting. The 
This is amazing. Because the DSR is activated, so let's deactivate it. I will press the vertical button for the settings and go to downhill speed. I will turn it off in this way. I can go downhill with my own pace. And over there you can see the GLS, which you don't need a GLS to go off-road. Let's take a right turn. Let's take a right turn over here as well. And we will do the same. a little bit faster without DSR and it actually feels quite comfortable going down Let's get up the hill, it is around 50% and I will press the home button information, there you can see, but I will stop in the center of this hill and there you can see 44 degrees. Let's get back to the information and I will show you if I hit the home button, the vertical button, that I can activate the downhill speed and then if I put it into reverse it also works going downhill I can feel it braking and controlling the situation so let's get up again I will deactivate the downhill speed and accelerate Therefore I need the camera of course to see if we have any obstacles. It looks good. Let's go. So imagine driving the G-Class with this portrait style screen and the cameras. I love all the leaves because of autumn. Looks beautiful. You really feel the benefit of having a greater ground clearance. Beautiful leaves. There you can see a small hut for checking the area. There is also of course the off-road plus, so I will press the dynamic button. Uh, therefore I have to deactivate the camera and there you can see a maximum speed of 45 kilometers an hour and this is really for rock areas. Because the off-road is more for if you want to have a little more speed, snowy areas or sand. And this angle is huge. I'm reading 50%. So guys, thanks for watching Mertzman's King. I hope you liked the video with the C-Class All-Terrain and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye bye!